Hey, how you guys doing? I back Lex. Yeah, so uh, M103. Before we start this, I wanted to go ahead and talk about, uh, you know, fully upgraded, you know, an armor specs. Uh, so this has a 200 millimeter plate in the front, and then the turret in the front is 256, and it's 99 on the sides, and 53 in the back of the turret. Now on the sides, they are 45, and on the rear, it's 45. Now the M103 has something pretty cool, and that is it has angled everything. Basically it's a circle underneath, it's like a, I don't know, maybe like an upside down Twinkie. So it's round on the bottom, meaning it's going to bounce, but uh, most likely you're going to get penetrated from the sides. But it really, uh, I'm just going to say, you get penetrated anyway, it's a weak point on all tanks, so it being 45 says maybe high explosive rounds might be able to do a lot of damage to this tank. So, anyway, I really like this tank. I've had really good luck with it. It has a uh, crazy turret. The turret looks like the Predator mask, seriously. Every time I look at it, I think Predator mask. <laughs> but, uh, so we have a new person in the clan, and that is uh, Fanny Smack. So, new person to NCT. He is running the Chinese WZ. It's basically the IS-8. The, the last Soviet, you know, that's a Chinese one, the WZ-101, I think it is. Um, it's an IS-8, but it's Chinese. Uh, Chinese tanks have a little bit better armor in the front. Um, yeah, I don't remember what uh, Fanny Smack told me about the Chinese line, but the Chinese line is pretty decent. I'm messing around right now. I, I just unlocked the IS-8, and I'm... You know, we just got it uh, working on getting it fully upgraded is what I'm actually going for. So this being fully upgraded was quite a quite a grind. And I would say that uh, under normal circumstances, I probably would get the mark of excellence on this tank. Just like I had on the Patton. But I don't actually have the mark of excellence. The reason why is I had a bunch of free XP. And I went ahead and spent it. And so that way half the grind I didn't have to do. So, yeah. <clears throat> Anyway, let's see how much damage we do with this. Boom. 538. I'm going to say that that was a split difference between somebody else and me. Um, and then I think I missed the shot. Yeah, there we go. So you guys do know I'm narrating after the fact. Um, looking at the game footage, I see myself kind of looking around for places to shoot. I want to go bottom plate on the E75, but I know that the turrets is a sure thing if you shoot it on the side. But I'm not going to waste my time shooting you know, in his front plate or on the bottom plate unless he has high ground on me. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about there, don't worry about it. It just means that I'm lower than him. Usually works out better. <laughs> so, the penetration for the gun. So, I'm going to go ahead and uh, tell you guys that it's a 120 millimeter gun, which is massive. But the penetration is just crazy. I mean, we're talking absolutely insane. It's a 258. 258 pin is crazy. So me and uh, Fanny Smack double team that guy, and then somebody else got the kill. That's actually how you get 414. That's good. <clears throat> so there's the IS-8, which is basically the Russian, right? The one next to me, uh, one that Fanny has, is the WZ version of that. Now... We we're actually talking right now. We're like, you know, let's go help this guy. We can see him getting messed up, so we're like, let's go get him. Let's just charge these guys. We don't even know what we're messing with, but we're feeling the the momentum here. <clears throat> Excuse me. So yeah, 258 pin. Now the gun before this, the pilot gun, that means the the middle gun. Um, it only had 18 difference. I think it's actually 17 difference, but that was a huge difference. When I'm playing up against tier 10s with this tank, that's the difference between bouncing and not. So you guys are going to see here, I'm up against an M103. I don't think he's upgraded, but boom. Got a lucky shot and hit him right on the bottom of the tank because he's got the high ground. I'm, I'm lower than him, which is probably the preferred, you know, angle. Now, instinctually, I just automatically shot that dude, which I actually snatched... Fanny's, uh, Fanny Smack's kill, and then he got mine almost immediately after. So it worked out, you know, and I was like basically telling him, you know, sorry about taking that. And he was like, no problem, because I already got the other one. Now this uh, E75, or is that a Tiger II? Tiger II, 
I don't know what he's doing, but he t just took almost, you know, 400 and I think it was 15 damage from me. And he just, you know, <laughs> he got wasted. So now we're going to head down to the coast and clean up these last bit of guys. So there's a VK and some other tanks. That tank's pretty OP. We're talking super powered. But we're only dealing with the... Uh, you know, some tier 9s, which we already took out most tier 9s. So, now we're just rolling here. So, the AMX here, a uh, pretty tough little tank here. So, there's his second kill. I got one kill, he's got two. You'll see, bam. I hit this guy. I'm waiting to reload. And, getting ready to hit him again. And, boom. Hit him again. I'm getting ready to ram him. And then, uh, you know... Uh, Fanny Smack gets the kill for it. Now, uh, one of the things that's cool about you know trading kills is that um, by giving your kill away to another person, you're more likely to get your mark of excellence, which I don't have on this tank. Um, now, I might keep this tank. I might sell it. To be honest, the American Heavy um, is a is a nice, maneuverable, quick, well balanced tank. Is about the best way you can describe it. It doesn't have the greatest armor. But it has great gun on it. Just like this one. This one has a really good gun. You're, you know, if you can, uh, if he was facing me, I could pin his bottom plate. You know, I could pin his bottom plate. Um, I can even pin the turret sometimes. And, yeah, I'm just wasting this guy. Now, I think I hit him one more time here. And, yeah, I do a lot of frontal damage to him. I'm much heavier. He's only a tier... I think he's a tier 7. And I'm getting ready to ammo rack him. But I aimed a little too high, so... Anyway. Going over here. And that's it. That's pretty much end of the game. Let's see what we get for this. Really good game. I got 2. Fanny got 4. Pretty good game overall. So, yeah. Decent money. And you guys will see here I got a confederate medal. And the way you get that is by shooting people but not actually taking the kill yourself. So that's really decent. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Comment, like, and subscribe. And have a good one. Later.